Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to solve this very nice Diophantine equation. 2 to the power a minus 1 is equal to a times b squared. Our job is to find all possible values of a and b such that a and b are positive integers. So let's start. The equation is 2 to the power a minus 1 is equal to a times b squared. Since this left hand side of the equation 2 to the power a minus 1 is a power of 2. So, this right hand side a times b squared must be a power of 2. And this a times b squared can only be a power of 2 if a is a power of 2 and b squared is a power of 2 and b squared can only be a power of 2 if b is a power of 2. So, we suppose that a is equal to 2 to the power k and b is equal to 2 to the power m. So, this given equation will become 2 to the power 2 to the power k minus 1 is equal to in place of a we write 2 to the power k times in place of b we write 2 to the power m whole squared. Next 2 to the power 2 to the power k minus 1 is equal to 2 to the power k times by using this property of exponents a to the power x whole to the power y is equal to a to the power x y. This 2 to the power m whole squared will become 2 to the power 2 times m. Next 2 to the power 2 to the power k minus 1 is equal to 2 to the power by using this property of exponents a to the power x times a to the power y is equal to a to the power x plus y. We add these powers k and 2m. So, this will become k plus 2m. Now, since we have same base at both sides, so we can write this 2 to the power k minus 1 equal to this k plus 2m. So, we get an equation 2 to the power k minus 1 is equal to k plus 2 times m. Move this k to the left hand side this will become 2 to the power k minus k minus 1 is equal to 2 times m. If we divide both sides by 2, this implies that m is equal to 2 to the power k minus k minus 1 divided by 2. Now, recall that a and b are positive integers and we have supposed that a and b are positive integers and we have supposed that a is equal to 2 to the power k and b is equal to 2 to the power m. We have supposed that a is equal to 2 to the power k and b is equal to 2 to the power m and both a and b are positive integers. Since a is a positive integer, so this k, k must be greater than or equal to 0. And this b is a positive integer, this m must be, m must be greater than or equal to 0. Now, we try different values of k to find the value of m. First, we set the value of k is equal to 0. So, we get the value of m is equal to 2 to the power 0 minus 0 minus 1 divided by 2 
this will become m is equal to 2 to the power 0 is 1 minus this one divided by 2 and this will become m is equal to 0 divided by 2 and m is equal to 0. So, when k is 0 then m will also be 0. So, now we can find the value of a by a is equal to 2 to the power k is 0 and a is equal to 1. In the same way b is equal to 2 to the power m is 0 and b will be 1. From here we get the first pair a comma b is equal to 1 comma 1. Now we copy this information and and we test another value of k. Now we set the value of k is equal to 1. So we get the value of m is equal to 2 to the power 1 minus 1 minus this one divided by 2 and this will become m is equal to 2 to the power 1 is 2 minus 1 minus 1 will become 2 divided by 2 and this will become m is equal to 0 divided by 2 and m is equal to 0. So, when k is 1 then m will be 0. So, a will be equal to 2 to the power 1 a is equal to 2 and b will be equal to 2 to the power m is 0 and b will be equal to 1. So, from here we get the second pair a comma b is equal to 2 comma 1. Now, we copy this equation and try another value of k. Now, we set the value of k is equal to 2. So, m will be equal to 2 to the power 2 minus 2 minus 1 divided by 2 and uh, m will be equal to 2 squared will become 4 minus 2 minus 1 will become 3 divided by 2 and this is equal to 1 over 2 which is not an integer. Now, we copy this information and set the value of k 3. Now, we set the value of k is equal to 3. This will become m is equal to 2 to the power 3 minus 3 minus 1 divided by 2 and uh, m will be equal to 2 cube is 8 negative 3 minus 1 will become negative 4 divided by 2 and this will become m is equal to 4 over 2 and m will be equal to 2. So, when k is 3 then m will be 2. So, a will be equal to a will be equal to 2 to the power 3 and a will be equal to 8, b will be equal to 2 to the power m is 2, this will become 2 squared and b will be equal to 4. From here we get another pair a comma b is equal to 8 comma 4. Now, we copy this information and uh, test the value of k 4. Now, we set the value of k is equal to 4. So, this will become m is equal to 2 to the power 4 minus 4 minus 1 divided by 2 and uh, m will be equal to 2 to the power 4 will become 16 and negative 4 minus 1 will become negative 5 divided by 2 and this will become m is equal to 11 over 2 that is not an integer. We notice that when k is an even number, when k is even we get uh, no solution for a and b. So, the final solution of uh, this equation is uh, a comma b is equal to 
टू टू द पावर के कामा टू टू द पावर एम वेयर के इज एन एलिमेंट ऑफ दिस सेट जीरो कामा वन कामा थ्री कामा फाइव एंड सो ऑन आर्ड नंबर एंड एम इज इक्वल टू दिस इक्वेशन टू टू द पावर के माइनस के माइनस वन डिवाइडेड बाय टू दिस इज द फाइनल आंसर ऑफ दिस प्रॉब्लम